Hello everyone, welcome to You Can Do TV channel. In your daily meals, you are exposed to a lot of delicious and nutritious fruits such as bananas, pears, apples, cherries. Have you ever wondered how people can provide fresh and nutritious fruits? Such care? In this video, You Can Do TV will go with you to find the answer. We will visit farms equipped with the most modern agricultural machinery to discover how they grow, harvest, and process types of fruits. Let's just get started. The ground nuts, after being harvested by peanut harvest machine, will be transported to the processing plant. Here, the modern lines will clean the peanuts, dry and separate the seeds. The damaged or uneven peanuts will be classified separately to ensure the uniformity and stable quality of the peanuts. The pears that come to the harvest season will be ripe with branches like this, they look delicious. At this time, the farmers began to organize the harvest, because pears are a fruit with a lot of water, so they are easily crushed, so to ensure that the pears are intact and not crushed, the farmers have to harvest them by hand. Harvesting machinery is very simple, just link trailers. The farmer picks the fruit one by one and loads it on the trailer. This cherry processing line can process tons of cherries in one day. After being harvested, the cherries will be put into this processing line, where they will go through the stages of cleaning, sorting and packaging. The process of sorting cherries based on size, freshness or pestilence by the most modern technologies available today. Bell peppers are grown in greenhouses and are cared for with great care to reduce the incidence of pests and diseases and give the best fruit yield. Chemical substances are hardly used or are used very little in cases where they are required. Bell peppers are a plant fruit but are eaten as a vegetable in tomato-like meals. They have a pungent taste and are less spicy, so in western dishes, bell peppers are often used in salads or as a topping on pizza. In terms of nutritional content, 
Raw green bell peppers are rich in vitamin C, it contains 94% water, 5% carbohydrates, negligible fat and protein. Preferred bell pepper growing conditions include moist, warm soil in a temperature range of 21 to 29 degrees Celsius, 70 to 84 degrees Fahrenheit. When ripe red, bell peppers have nearly twice the vitamin C content and eight times the vitamin A content of green bell peppers. Bananas are one of the most consumed and cheapest fruits worldwide. In terms of trade volume, they are the most traded fruit, with an estimated retail value of several tens of billions of dollars globally. Bananas are self-replacement perennials, unlike many other crops that grow from seeds, banana plants grow from bulbs or rhizomes. With a growth period not too long, from sowing banana tubers to harvesting it only takes from 9 to 12 months and grows all year round, not fixed or dependent on crops and weather. Bananas are grown mostly in the tropics, where the average temperature is 80 degrees Fahrenheit, 27 degrees Celsius, and an annual rainfall between 78 and 98 inches. Most export bananas are grown within 30 degrees on both sides of the equator. Bananas are usually harvested when they are still green, after about 9 months of growing. Once harvested, the bananas are shipped to packers, where they are inspected and sorted for export. To meet export standards, bananas need to meet very high standards including fruit size and uniformity, freshness, color and many other important criteria. If bananas do not meet these standards, they are often sold locally for much less. Once packed, Bananas are stored and transported in cold containers, usually at a temperature of 13.3 degrees Celsius. During transport, bananas need to be handled with care because they are easily crushed and damaged. When the bananas arrive at their destination port, they are first taken to a ripening room, a process involving ethylene gas, and then sent to stores. Thank you for watching the whole video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see other useful videos from You Can Do TV.